Hi everyone, how are you all doing? It is me, Kathy. I'm back. Sorry I didn't do a video yesterday. I was absolutely exhausted and I could hardly speak. So today I thought I'd do a video on invisible symptoms of fibromyalgia. So, first one, widespread muscle pain. Number two, tender joints. Three, achy bones. I mean, achy bones, painful bones. Uh, <laughs> then there's cramps. Stiffness, numbness, tingling, chronic fatigue, weakness, exhaustion, insomnia, I can't say that, insomnia, I said that, oh, what was it, sleep problems, nausea, feeling sick, and IBS, which is irritable bowel syndromes, abdominal, one second the pit, animals will start to come in, Abdominal, I can't say how oh, it's like tummy pains, slow digestion, constipation, brain fog, which people know it as fibro fog, headaches, migraines. What are you doing? Difficulty with speaking, like sometimes you'll see on my videos, I struggle with my speech, it could be slurry, could be like did it stuttering, that's the word. Depression which is affecting me at the minute. Still not heard from my CPA, but I'll get into that in a minute. Ir uh, anxiety can be another one. Irritable, irritability, ir not irritated type of thing. Mood, mood swings, basically. I can't say that long word. I've written it down so I don't forget. Sensitivity by loud noises and also lights. Now, I hate loud noises. If I'm out and about, so muscles are killing. If I'm out and about and there's an ambulance, I have to pull or obviously pull to the side and I have to put my fingers in my ears because what are you doing to my bed? Cat's like needing. Um, no second, check my bed. Ooh, I'm running about. Sorry about the lights. Hannah, do you want to put oven on for me, please, so, so it gets warmed up? Um, yeah. I can't deal with loud noises like ambulance sirens, police and fire. I can't, it just goes right through me and oh, I can't deal with it. Sorry, okay. Ooh, no, I fell then. So, okay, this is, excuse me, that's on my bed, but this is. Hello. Which is <laughs> uh, like kneading on my bed to get comfy. Um, so, yeah, they are kind of some of them, but. Obviously, it varies from, it can differ from person to person. So, someone could. Did I say chronic fatigue? Yeah, chronic fatigue as well, and pain. Oh, that's just some of them. As I was researching, more well, researching, it popped up on my Facebook, and I thought, oh, I'll have that. Thank you very much. And I'll talk to a few people that suffer with fibro. Um, also, I can't, I've gone to say, <laughs> so I'm holding on to it, yeah. Like, oh. Um, so I'm just going to go and get a quick bath. What are you doing, Bella? Getting comfy. You need to go sort your babies out. They're six weeks now. And we want to start uh, feeding them wet food next week. So that's going to be challenging. Anyway, so fibromyalgia, um, I hate it. And I'm probably not the only one. Because it stops you from doing what you want to do and was able to do. Um, and... It makes you cancel plans on the last minute where I've got something coming up tomorrow. I'm already thinking, should I go? Uh, yeah, I do want to go because it's obviously... I'll talk about that later because I need to ask permission before I even talk about it because she might not want me to talk about it, but I've got something on tomorrow with my friend. And, you know, what's putting me off is, is to drive there because I don't know the area. Even though I've got, what you call it, Google Maps, I still don't trust them. I still, I get nervous when it goes, right, turn the next turning. Ah. But it gives you a first warning, doesn't it? And then the second time, that's when you do the turning. But it's the roundabouts. I don't know if there's any roundabouts. I'm just freaking out about it. And she said I could follow them in the car, but what if I get stuck at a red light and they've gone in the distance? 
Anyway, guys, I'm going to leave it that for now because I'm absolutely shattered and I'm still trying to recover from yesterday's tiredness. I'm already tired for tomorrow. <laughs> so I just thought I'd uh, make... I want to go and get in that bath and then, and then it's tea time. Um, yeah, so that's it for today, really. I just wanted to talk about some of the symptoms that I have put on. Maybe put a comment below and let me know if there's other symptoms that I haven't said because I know there's crumbly teeth, that's one. And that's something I suffer with. And I've got a sweet tooth, I can't lie. Um, but yeah, at the minute my fibro is not helping my depression. I am getting teary in the night. I am sick of being pain, in pain. And it does get to you. I'm not, I'll probably get to everybody. Can you imagine just living? You're not really living, you're just surviving. Is that the word? You're not living a good life anyway. So pop a comment on below. Let me know what you you suffer with if it's not on the list that I've said. I just thought I'd just pop it up here because I didn't do a video yesterday and I do apologise yeah in fact I did start doing one and then I stopped and then I forgot about it and then I deleted it because I was just too exhausted to even talk and I didn't want people picking on because I've, I've had an email from someone that didn't, wasn't very nice and I'm like well if you don't like my videos don't watch it that's simple as and yeah I'll see you later guys thanks again for watching i'll catch up with you in the next video and don't forget to hit the like button that subscribe button if you're new to this channel and notification bell see you later guys